Ay Ay, Cody Simpson. From the Smoker Show, Lucas and Hayden. Thank you all for listening to us for the Smoko Show. How are you, my little friend Hayden? I'm good. Are you good? How what what class did you have? Um, numeracy with Mr. Rap Mr. Smith. Mr. Smith. Mr. Rap. Wait, Mr. Smith. Mr. Yes. Smith. Smith. Do you have him? Yes. Why do you have him? Um. Is it? Is it? Wait, it, wait. Take no off. clue. No is he a good teacher? Is he a good teacher to you? Do you um, like him? Sometimes. He's good. Yeah. Sometimes, yes, no. I'll just back to give us a whole explanation of the whole lesson, so sometimes I'm a bit there on that, but yeah, but some of the other time, the, the I mean, class, yeah. yeah, it always it always happens, it always happens. Yeah, so. he gives that one teacher. Yeah, I mean, well, what, what classes do you have coming up? Um, I have kinesiology this afternoon, oh and yes. next I do not know. Do not know? I know I have. Then what do we have? I don't know. It's a Tuesday, so I think we have. I don't, we don't have a chosen. I don't know. My, well, I, I've, I've, I can't tell if I changed every term. <laughs> <laughs> they, they, they just like, a oh, oh. I'm a caveman now. No brain cells. No nothing. Oh, Lucas, I have a, pi- I have a question for you. Yes. What do you think of the year nines only having one math class a, a week? What? Yeah. One. Uh, th- today was my first and what? only class of numeracy. The week. That's a scam. I because, know, because right? In year 10, I have a uh, year, I have two, Tuesday to Thursday. Oh, that's probably my next class, Matt. <laughs> <laughs> Good probably. Luck. Yeah. And then, <laughs> Problem um, solving. And then in year 9, I took a math class. Oh. So that's a scam. Oh, well, the thing is, I, I actually um, last year had like four math classes a week. Oh, God. I have 25%. That's my math coming in, dear. Oh. <laughs> from last year, not this year. Ah, yeah, it's very funny. Anyway, it's yeah. Lil Nas because that's what I want. It's his newest song. You're on your head station. Lil Nas X, well, that's what I want. You're on the Smoker Show with Lucas and Hayden. Now, Hayden, did you watch the Apple event this morning? No. No? Do you know what time it was in the morning? Hmm. 6 a.m. I got up at 5.50 a.m. to go watch an Apple event, and it was boring. No, no, I'm kidding. It was actually really cool. My rule, my rule of thumb when I wake up at morning is, wake up at six o'clock. Yep. Stay in bed. That's mm. max. Because then I have like uh, hours get ready. Bed. Yeah. For me, it's six thirty. But I'm like, I'm gonna get up and watch this event because I'm not skipping out one like like I did with when they announced the um, iPhone twelve or something like that. The, the one that Zane watched. It was like iPhone thirteen. iPhone thirteen. IPhone. Sorry. My bad. Zane, uh, Zane got up and watched that one. What time was that? Like five, 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 five o'clock, six o'clock. I oh, know it was earlier than that. I know. Uh, Zane. So I got up, and then the first thing they announced is the um, home the HomePod Mini. It's a little, tiny little, you know how Alexa is and uh, Siri yeah. and stuff. Yeah, but she has little mini uh, version of that, but it comes in three new colors. So they had the oh. white and space gray. Comes in a little dark, vibing blue. Way yes, a little dark, vibing blue, which is really cool. Oh, that sounds it. nice. A b- like quite vibey, bright yellow, and very really cool orange. Okay. Another thing they announced is AirPods 3, you know, with more features, more playback, some of that stuff. Okay, yeah. And then the new MacBook Pro, oh. which is now comes in a 16 and 14 inch, a new chip, apparently. Oh, new chip. Yeah, like the M1 chip. Do you, do you know how can normal computers have four i7s yeah. and i9s? Of course. Yeah, it's, it's basically like that. It's oh. like, so it was like the M1 chip, they call it the M1 Pro and the M1 Max. Okay. Stupid yeah. names. M1 Pro and M1 Max. Like, I feel like they need to call us different things than Max and Pro. <laughs> Max Pro. Max Pro. Uh, okay, the one thing I know, you know, the whole thing they were saying is notebook. Oh, yeah. Notebook, notebook, notebook. It's like, it's not a notebook, it's a MacBook. <laughs> it's really annoying, but anyway, it's Anxiety by Willow. One of her new songs. You're on your hit station. Meet us at our spot. Anxiety and Willow and Tyler Cole. You're into Shredder. Sorry, I got that name wrong before. That's on me. Oh, I hate the metric. Fucking made your check from the producer's booth. Yes. Don't worry. He, yes, he did. He's like, it's wrong. And I'm like, I'm sorry. I, okay, so you know that funny when you uh, hear it? Yeah. But you don't actually know what actually, like, song name? Yeah. I, I thought it was called Anxiety because it's on the bottom corner. But yeah. actually, it's called me at our spot. That's mm. on me. I always do that. Always have and always will. <laughs> it's very sad, but yeah. It we're is we're true. Yes, it, it is very true, but we will jump into our... Actually, no. It's actually a new song by Adele. Ooh. A 
first time we jumped on a unique song by Nathan Hawk. We jumped to the newest song. It's Adele, Easy On Me. You're on it. Adele with Easy On Me. You're on the Smoker Show, Lucas and Hayden. That is it for us, folks. I will see you on the lunchtime part. Yeah, see you at lunchtime, 12.20. 12.20, indeed. Oh, oh, damn it. Stop it. Oh, yes, indeed. I'm, I'm, I'm not going to do that. Anyway, <laughs> jump to my next song. Okay, so holiday. You're on your head station. Dio with Hideaway. You're on the Smoker Show with Lucas and Hayden. Hayden, how are you, my friend? Great. Just had history class. Oh, history. Um, let me guess. That was with Mr. Chan. Um, no, it's not Mr. Chan. Most not Mr. Chan. No. Yes. Oh, uh, so, so um, uh, I think I'm taking year uh, ten history. Um, probably that. Yeah, because if you are, he's you have Mr. Chan. He's really oh. nice. He's really understanding. I've already had him before. Yeah. Man, and he's yeah. had to leave because of some some unfor- unfortunate incidents with some other kids. But yes. Um, we won't get into that today because I've been running all day about that. Yes. Uh, he is a very positive and energetic uh, teacher. Like he actually okay. explains stuff well. Yeah, he is very nice. Yes, any, anyway, we'll jump to our next song. It's yep. Doja Cat with Kiss Me More. Doja Cat with Kiss Me More. You're on the Smoker Show with Lucas and Hayden. Now, Hayden, we all know we have, well, you know how that song was by Doja Cat, right? What two artists do you think should collab with each other? So you know how, like, Justin Bieber and the Kudder Y did with Stay? Well, what would be a really good match that you haven't heard yet? I'm not good with artists, to be honest. Yeah, I mean, I, re- I reckon what a good one should be. You know how Elton John and Dua I knew yeah. if you thought that combo would ever come. Oh, yeah, true. Yeah, but I wonder if Justin Bieber and Dua Lipa have done a, a collab before. I don't think they have. Zane, search it up on Google. <laughs> no, he can't. He's busy. Oh, he He's up. busy, yeah, my mind. guy. Oh. Anyway, we'll jump to our next song. It is Pink Sweat at my worst. You're on FCC of the radio. That was at my worst, Pink Sweat. You're on FCC radio. Very good, my friend. Now, Hayden, have you heard of the um, post we have, we've put on Instagram? Um, no, I have not. No, so Declan has a mullet, and he is, well, we want to get rid of it, in other words. So oh, okay. me and Gabe want to get rid of it. So on, the, on this morning, we put up a post saying, what do we do with Declan's mullet? Should we shave it? Or should we turn it into a skullet? Do you, do you even know what a skullet is? No, I do not know what a skullet is. Okay, so a skullet is basically where you're bald at the top, so just the mullet part. Okay. Just, just, the, mullet. just the mullet part. Oh, God. So if you're bald with a mullet, but but if, we, if it does go to that. All right. That does be, sound very weird. He'll, he'll be bald. He'll, he'll be good for one weekend, and then we'll get rid of it all. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yes. It'll be really interesting, but currently, uh, for shave it, has 13 votes, and turn it into a skullet has 10 votes. Oh. Thank God, it's pretty close. It is. And it has been seen by, last time I checked, it was 34 people. Oh, gosh. 34 people have seen it, but only around about 20-ish people have voted. Okay. Well, but if come you're on, listening people. out there, vote for the skull. I actually want to see that. Oh, my God, no. No. It'll be skull horrible. It, skull it. No. Skull it. I voted for shave it because I just want it gone. <laughs> all, all we're going to do is just like trim the back of it off, you know? Well, the skirt's going to be the best part because you get the boldness and then you eventually get the full boldness. Yes. So, I hope that changes yeah. your mind. But yeah, but also, also if, if it does come to the skullet, oh, we'll we'll, the skullet one, we, we, if, it, if we, we can't really find any, any, any toys or anything, he'll just be shaved again next year. Okay, yeah, okay, so that's fair. So, uh, yeah. It'll help a good cause and it'll also get him without a mullet. Yes, indeed. <laughs> The song's a okay. I hope you're doing okay at home listening to us. <laughs> you're on Hurt Station. Hey, that was a okay. You're on STC Radio. Yes, indeed. Now, look, Hayden, no, we did, so we just had school holiday. Coming yeah. up is the big summer six-week school holiday. Oh, yeah. What, so we all, we all listen to music in our own time and stuff, you know? But yeah. what is the best speaker for summertime for you? What do you oh. think? One, yeah, because yeah. there's so many speaker brands out there that are competing yeah. to make them better. I mean, personally, I have two speakers at home. Oh. They're both Ultimate Ears. Oh. I got a Yui Boom 2, which I've had for about five, four years. Five, oh, actually, coming up five, six years. Oh. Amazing speaker. 
and then uh, since since that one's dying, I think over a year ago I bought a Boom Three. So I I really like them ones because they have good bass, good volume, good everything. I'm hoping my dream speaker is three hundred fifty dollars, which oh, is yes. expensive for me. Oh, it's up to you. It's not too no, it's not too bad. It's for me. Yeah. But it's three speakers in one. It's a big bottom speaker that's for like the ground, and then oh, there's two speakers on the side, which just make it feel like surround sound. It's amazing. Actually, yeah. That, that, yeah. That, 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 test test uh, demo. Very fun. For 350 bucks, that doesn't sound too bad. For a subwoofer and two, two speakers, it's actually not too bad. Yeah. I mean, for the, so there's like three brands I know that actually sell really good speakers. So it's Ultimate Ears, yep. Sony, which does a lot yes, of stuff. a like, lot of stuff. Like cameras, TVs, PlayStation. Yeah. All that stuff. And then JBL. JBL, yeah. That's yeah. where I go to most of my technology. Yes. Yeah. GABL is actually a really good company. Yeah. But I, I really think Yui is actually the best one here of all time because they have prices and cheap. Yeah, stuff. it's very cheap. Yes, yeah, so, so they have like a big, big one and they got and they got like really small ones. Yeah, very so small. So they have really good range. And they're in really good colors, like you can get them like fresh and white and they're really, really cool. Of course. This is Vance Joy, Missing P. You're on your hit station. Vance Joy with Missing P. You're on your head station. Hayden, we all know stuff that we hate, right? We, we just hate some stuff. But what Brothers. are some really ugly, o- oddly satisfying stuff you, you know, you, you know stuff you just love, stuff oh. that you can't resist? There's the classic bubble wrap. That's a classic. Uh, yeah, kind of. Bubble yeah. wrap's a okay for me. I, I don't really. I mean, it, it's, it's satisfying when you're young. Yes, definitely. But, but now it's not really it's satisfying. It's becoming a bit less, but it's still. Yes, pretty sad. Because you're a bit older. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I'd probably have to say once the project's done, I'm a nerd. Yeah. I mean, the one, like, there's, like, a couple things. Are, like, one of them is a perfectly closing laptop. You know, you just go, well, boom. And then and there's, like, a really soft uh, closing sound. Yes. Down the bed. And another thing is peeling back a wrapper on a brand new iPhone. Like, little rip back from the back. Yeah. I watched, I watched so many videos of them. It's like, mm, these are so satisfying. I, 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 I just can't resist them. They're yeah. They're always there just for me. I've they're only done it once, but I wish I could do it again. Oh, yeah. You're just like, hold up. Just rip, 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 rip. Just back, back and forth. Just keep going. Yeah. Going. They're always the best. They're yep. always the best. Just like this song. It's Elton John and Dua Lipa <laughs> with Cold Heart. Dua Lipa and Elton John with Cold Heart. Thank you all for listening to the Smoko, well, lunchtime part of the Smoko show. Hayden, do you want to say goodbye to the um, listeners? Um, good. Bye to everyone. I will see you tomorrow, so we're we'll Hayden, and that is it for us. This one's a bit of a throwback. It's Katy Perry with Hot Cold. You You're on HTC Radio.